Hello and welcome to another video for the Joyful Adventure Audits channel. Today we're looking at the story of the Jekyll and Hyde pub on Steelhouse Lane which sadly closed down during the pandemic but has now been revived and reopened under a historical name, the Queen's Head. The Jekyll and Hyde Backstory The Jekyll and Hyde first opened back in 2009 and quickly became a fixture in Birmingham's nightlife scene. Known for its quirky Victorian theming and popular gin parlor, the unique pub offered a little slice of history and whimsy in an updated package that appealed to modern patrons. Closure during pandemic. Unfortunately, the Jekyll and Hyde did not reopen after the COVID lockdowns like so many other hospitality businesses impacted financially. After 12 great years, the owners made the tough call to permanently shut its doors in 2021, leaving its fate uncertain. New lease of life. Luckily the story doesn't end there. The prominent building has now been leased and renovated by local brewery Davenports. Reopening last year, the pub has been rechristened the Queen's Head in a nod to its former identity in the 1800s as well as the Platinum Jubilee. While the interior has been updated, real ale offerings and brand signage incorporate its long pedigree on Steelhouse Lane dating back before 1850. It's wonderful when historic pubs get a second act. The value of community pubs. The loss of so many hospitality businesses these past few years makes revivals like that of the Queen's Head all the more sweet and essential for communities. Beyond just another place to grab a pint, pubs like this foster connection and a sense of home. That's why it's so important we get out and support them. So let me know in the comments if you'll be stopping by the new old Queen's Head soon or have your own memories of the Jekyll and Hyde in its heyday. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Cheers! If these walls could talk, the stories they would tell from over 150 years of pints and good times inside this pub. We can only imagine the quick drinks knocked back before heading into the nearby courts to hear verdicts. The office workers popping by for a round at the end of busy weeks. Police from the local Steelhouse Lane station relieved to be off duty. And generations of Brummies gathering here to celebrate life's milestones. If these walls could talk, they'd echo with memories of friends, old and new toasting to connections made within the cozy confines through the decades. Debates, laughter, event toasts, quiet first dates, raucous nights all those moments that made up the richer history of this space beyond what any plaque outside could summarize. The Jekyll and Hyde had its chapter, but now the newly dubbed Queen's Head carries the torch of being the beating heart of Steelhouse Lane. While giving a fresh face towards future memories, within its bones hide the echoes of all those who came before. Now we fill its next pages. So may the stories continue, with more tales of camaraderie awaiting around the bend. Cheers to the past and future within these walls that have heard it all.